Super creamy chicken pie, easy and quick to make. To start our recipe, in a frying pan I will add olive oil. I will add a whole onion, 3 cloves of garlic and saute a little. Now I will add 500 g of shredded chicken and stir again. In the sequence I will add 200 grams of corn, 200 grams of pa and I will stir again mixing all the ingredients. Now I will add a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of curry, a teaspoon of paprika, a teaspoon of turmeric and finally a teaspoon of black pepper and I will stir everything very well. I have no doubt that this recipe will impress you, make it at your home and then tell me what you think. Next, I added 4 tablespoons of tomato extract and I will stir until the tomato extract is joined with all the shredded chicken. Then, I will add a little parsley and stir well so that the parsley adds to our recipe completely. Now in a container, I will add 4 whole eggs and half a cup of oil. I'm going to stir so that our oil mixes completely with the eggs. Then I added 350 milliliters of milk, I will stir well. I will add 2 cups of wheat flour, I will sift and stir well, then I will add a tablespoon of baking powder and I will stir until all ingredients are well mixed. Finally, I will add all our chicken and stir so that the chicken is incorporated in the dough completely. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Shalia Pierce from Mississippi. I'm glad you're enjoying our recipes. I poured all our recipe in a greased pan with butter and then I will put cottage cheese on top of our pie, remembering that it is optional. I finished with a little oregano on top and I will take it to the preheated oven at 360 Fahrenheit degrees for 45 minutes. Okay, look how incredibly delicious our pie was. I doubt you've ever tasted any chicken pie as tasty as this. I'm sure you'll come back here to thank me for teaching you this recipe. Make this recipe to take that family Sunday lunch, I have no doubt that will be the highlight of the dishes. Whenever I make her here at home, there's nothing so wonderful that she stays. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video so far, I see you in the next video. Bye!